goes up the ice. The unselfish play, number 12, Sutter going to the net. That opens up the seam for Legion to pass the puck to Gillies, who just wires it right by Jeremy Smith. You see 12, Sutter going to the net, and then a puck in off the right pad of Jeremy Smith. That is a flawlessly displayed three on two by Canada. That's how you do it. Strong down the wall, hard to the net, wing to wing, bam to the net. That's just spectacular hockey by the checkers of Canada. It's a meltdown for the Americans. We talked about having to deal with all these different things that go on in this tournament. And they came into this tournament really happy, really excited, and thinking they finally had a chance to beat the Americans. This stick went up into the crowd. He wants it back because that's the magic stick that got him a goal. <laughs> But again, it's the meltdown. It's Canada moving the puck, chipping it in deep, and then turnover. Turnover by Bobby Sanguinetti, and then Brad Marchand jumping on it and finishing it off. Bad body position by Brian Strait. And Brad Marchand, Canada up 4 nothing. Goals 20 seconds apart have given Canada a four-goal lead. Two turnovers on the same sequence by two defenders you really need. Bobby Sanguinetti and Brian Strait, they both turn the puck over, and Brad Marchand makes it 4 nothing. Ten seconds to go. Sanguinetti across the line. Sends it in front. Poposo shoots, hit the goal post. McVay, time expires. Canada is going to the gold medal game with the World Junior for the seventh straight year. And there it will meet the only team that's beaten it in this tournament, Sweden. Craig Hartsburg, real courageous decision to stick with Steve Mason. He made the right call, obviously, based on the outcome of today's game. They got the matchups that they wanted. The Checkers, Legion, Sutter, Gillies coming up with the third goal of the game, a huge goal. Brad Marchand was a tower of strength playing on a line with Turris and Giroux. But every Canadian player stepped up and elevated their game. This is the best this team has played all tournament. And Steve Mason was a guy that had to play guilty because of the game against Finland. He did play guilty. He was tremendous. You know, Pierre, every Canadian team has a personality. The last couple have been two before this were very intense. Brent Sutter style teams, the last two years, they've been like their coach. Yeah. Oh, good point. 